Congratulations! You have made the best choice and bought Kent Atta and Bread Maker. Come, let's see what we have got inside. So this Kent Atta and Bread Maker comes with quality stainless steel body. It comes with a measuring cup for measuring the ingredients like flour, water, etc. Then we have got this measuring spoon to measure the quantities of sugar, salt and yeast. Then we have got this kneading panel remover to remove the hot bread pan. Then we have got this kneading paddle. It mixes the dough. Then comes our bread pan in which we add all the ingredients necessary for baking or kneading dough or any other recipe. Lastly, we have got this instruction manual that gives you all the details about the product and recipes for all the preset menus. Comes with 19 preset menus. It not only makes homemade fresh bread, but it needs atta dough. It bakes cake, makes jam and so much more. The buttons you see below them lets you choose the preset menu, weight, timing, crust color of your choice and this button for start, stop and pause. The digital display allows you to see your chosen settings with ease. Press start button after selecting your desired settings. Its bread pan is very easy to remove. Just turn it anti-clockwise and here you're good to go. And now the kneading paddle. You need to put it in the middle of the bread pan like this and then put it back into the machine. So let's see how easily it works. So today I'm going to make 500 grams of basic bread for which I'll add 180 ml of water, 1 spoon salt, 2 spoons sugar, 2 scoops of oil, 300 grams of refined flour and 1 spoon of yeast which is readily available in the market. Press 1 for basic bread. Select 500 gram for weight. Choose the color of the crust you want and press start. I have selected the preset option for basic bread. Here, it will knead the dough for 25 to 30 minutes. Then it will ferment the dough for 90 minutes and another 60 minutes for baking it. So all in all, your bread will be ready in about 3 hours. Just a minute left and the aroma of this fresh bread is making me so impatient. So here we have this homemade super soft fresh bread. This is so amazing, you'll forget those store bought white, brown and multigrain bread. Now let's see how it works for kneading atta dough. So far you have been kneading atta dough by hand which might not be the most hygienic way. But now you can do so without touching. What you need to do is add 330 ml of water, salt as per your choice, half scoop of oil and three and a half cups of atta. And select your preset menu. The quantity of water can be adjusted if you use less flour and your dough is ready in just seven minutes. And if you're looking to knead the dough for puris, for which the dough has to be slightly tight, again, the process is very easy. Add 330 ml of water, salt as per your choice, 3 spoons of oil and 3 and a half cups of whole wheat flour and select your preset menu. And your dough is ready. Make any recipe. When the process is complete, the appliance will make 10 beeps and it will automatically stop. So put on your chef cap and with its 19 preset menus, you can make a variety of bread such as basic bread, sweet bread, french bread, whole wheat bread, gluten free bread, dry fruit bread and other items like pizza dough, neat chapati or puri atta bake cake, make jam, etc. All in all, I could say that this Kent Atta and Bread Maker 
not only helps you with making homemade fresh bread and knead atta dough, but also ensures your hygiene and lets you choose your favorite ingredients.